This Sunday, we're going to continue looking at what it means to be a Methodist and how we can learn from John Wesley. We're also going to be looking at how we can learn from Charles Wesley. Our focus this Sunday is on holiness, even what Wesley called Christian perfection or entire sanctification. Right now, I want to look at it in uh, in view of Charles Wesley's great hymn, Love Divine, All Loves Excelling. We, we sing in that hymn, Love Divine, All Loves Excelling, Joy of Heaven to Earth Come Down, Fix in Us thy humble dwelling, all thy faithful mercies crown. Now it sounds as we sing that, like we're talking to love, as if love is personified, as if love is active and doing something. This love is greater than any other love. It excels, it exceeds all love. It's the joy of heaven. It brings joy in heaven. When you look at heaven and imagine how joyous heaven is, this is what makes it that, this love that we're singing about. And it's this love that has come down to earth now. And and we sing, we pray even, fix in us thy humble dwelling. Live in us. Fix, make make your home in us. All thy faithful mercies crown. Then the next line, we see who this love is. Jesus. Jesus is this love. Jesus, thou, you are all compassion. Pure, unbounded love thou art. Unbounded. There's no limits. No boundaries. Our culture likes to say, oh, no boundaries, no limits. It's Jesus, whose love is unbounded. Jesus, thou art all compassion, pure unbounded love thou art. Visit us with thy salvation. Enter every trembling heart, every heart that's yearning for you, every heart that's stressed out, every heart that's fearful, that's worried, that's anxious, that's feeling defeated, that feels like there's no hope. Even, I'd say, every heart that's feeling feeling totally self-sufficient, that feels like, oh yeah, I've got this under control, and even saying that with sincerity. Even that heart, Jesus wants to come into and bring life and wholeness and healing. 